welcome to the Asia and the Pacific Transport Forum. The 2024 Forum sharply focuses on ADB's instrumental role in leveraging transport as a dynamic catalyst for sustainable development, addressing climate change, and advancing the sustainable development goals. We have with us today Filipino-American rapper, breakdancer, record producer, philanthropist, Apple the App. This is uh, to try to research the best way to successfully electrify uh, Philippines. that we've learned so much or made so many mistakes here in Manila um, when it comes to our transportation system, how it's grown over time. And we want to make sure that when we are developing transportation infrastructure in other places throughout the country, we're doing it better. The International Road Federation works to really bridge the gap between policy and action uh, in our sector. Uh, we do that by bringing people together to make sure that we discuss uh, common problems and we find and build solutions together. Renewable energy, uh, most suitable for a specific modes of transport, remain a question. So I think collaboration among the stakeholder, relevant stakeholders is really uh, needed and uh, you know, very uh, pressing. ADB was able to commit its highest ever level of climate finance, so at 9.8 billion, which significantly scaled up from the year before at 6.7 billion. And this included 1 billion for, for non sovereign, uh, as well as a lot of, you know, for example, in the transport sector, it was 2.5 billion. ADB is proud that we are the climate bank for Asia and the Pacific, and that's also true in the transport sector, where we look to decarbonize and build pathways. Within low, middle-income countries, we're looking to raise awareness on the options available and support investments and technical assistance for that decarbonization. <laughs>